Arena. Susanna. All right, Gio, I know that you have won this competition a couple of times before, but how sweet is the third time? Um, yeah, never, never gets old winning titles with your country, so um, I won't take any of them for granted. I'm so happy for the guys and how we played today and how we fought through adversity, and it was uh, just a great game. I'm so happy for everyone. You scored in a final before. You scored tonight. You have a whole bunch of assists in this competition. You look like you are playing with so much joy. How much fun are you having being back with these guys? Uh, you know, the group of guys and the energy we have here, um, it's, it's amazing. I always love coming to camp. Uh, it's really, I really mean it from the bottom of my heart. It's a great group of guys, and they're so great to work with and be around. Um, so, yeah, I can't really say much more. I'm lost for words right now, and it's just, just an honor to play with these guys from my country. As you look ahead to what's going to be a big summer for the United States, how important was this win and winning this title? Uh, I think it's big for momentum. I think... We've been together with our core group for a while now, and I think we know what it takes to win big games and, and tournaments, and hopefully we can carry that into Copa America and, you know, have a great run there and maybe even lift a trophy. So um, that's a little bit far down the road, but I just want to enjoy tonight with the guys. Okay, before I let you go, how happy are you for Tyler Adams and that strike? Oh, my God. I, he's right over there. I, I love him to death. He's also being in... Uh, I've had my tough moments through injuries and uh, a few years ago, so um, I know what it takes and I know how hard it is. And yeah, I'm just I'm just so happy for him. He's a great guy. He's so important for the team and for the group as a leader. And obviously, as a player, you saw the performance he did tonight. And uh, unfortunately, he was on minutes restriction. We would, I would have loved that and not there a little bit more, but no, nah, I, I just love him. I'm so happy for him, and that uh, yeah, hopefully we can just build on and keep continuing with our relationship on and off the pitch for the next 10 years, hopefully. So. Geo, congratulations. Go celebrate. Thank you very much. Boy, what a statement you made. A wonder strike. Can you take me through that goal and what it felt like when the ball left your foot? Yeah, no. First off, I'm excited to be back with this group. This team means a lot to me. We've been through a lot. I've known them all for a long time. And obviously, Greg has done an amazing job. So when I knew I was starting, I was really excited, of course, because I know the impact that I can have. Not scoring goals like that all the time, but I'm happy that I could hit one like that today. Well, it was your second goal for the U.S., and it, your first one was also against Mexico. You just have a knack for scoring against your biggest rival. What's that about? Yeah, something for big games. I always get up for big games. I want to ask how special this moment is for you, because not only are you back, but your son has been here, and you're here with your family. What does it mean to you to be able to share these special moments with your family and now your newborn son? Yeah, it means a lot. You know, like I said, the last time that I played with the national team, obviously life looked a lot different. Um, now with the, my son here, my fiance here, um, the impact that they both have had on me has been phenomenal. They've gotten me through a lot of dark times. Um, but yeah, being here and sharing this moment with them, I can't wait to see them and give them a big hug. Um, but it means the world to me. I want to ask about uh, the halftime conversation with Greg. How hard did you push <laughs> to stay in this match? I know you were on some minute restrictions, but I have a feeling you pushed back. Yeah, I mean, I told him I wanted to play 120 yesterday. So um, to come out at halftime was obviously disappointing, especially after after scoring a goal and helping the team. So, yeah, I, I understand we have to be smart for the long term plan. It's not just to play minutes now. It's to play for Copa America, another World Cup and so on. So I still have a long career ahead of me. I want to be smart in what I'm doing, um, but it was a tough discussion how special is this group it looks like it's a group that are really playing for each other you guys love being around each other I saw how happy they were for you yeah, yeah. when you scored that yeah. goal what does it mean it means everything these guys are like brothers to me like I said I grew up with a lot of them I've known them all for such a long time and if I didn't grow up with them I was watching them from afar keeping track on their development and what they're doing so to bring this group together and see how far we've come in the past couple of years says a lot you know people have a lot of question marks about this about that but to see what we do week in week out when we have the opportunity to work together we continue to grow, so it's special. Welcome back, Captain. Thank you very much. Congrats. Thank you.